So first up, the video that we put up last night has also been altered. Our views have changed. So keep an eye out on the views of this video and others um, and see if you see anything fishy going on. Um, in other news, and what I really wanted to talk about tonight, is Julian Assange, the founder of WikiLeaks. Um, there's been various rumours included on um, Before It's News and many other um, online sites that Julian Assange may be dead or compromised and that WikiLeaks may even be compromised. Um, it was reported on Before It's News from someone claiming to be a staffer of WikiLeaks um, saying that there was a, a global raid that happened simultaneously with Julian Assange's internet being cut off more than a month ago now and that they raided up to, I think it was 14 WikiLeaks staffers simultaneously um, the day after Julian Assange reported dis dissatisfaction with a vegan meal brought to him by none other than Pamela Anderson, um, which could mean that he's been poisoned. Um, the ne the same day that the there was a raid reported on the embassy that his security detail was reported missing, um, that he that the closest airport was shut down to due to an apparent chemical attack, or something sus like that. There's there's a lot of strange coincidences going on. And it's the kind of thing that we should probably be asking more questions about rather than just believing what's being told to us. And if WikiLeaks is indeed compromised, we can no longer rely on them as a credible source of information on anything, including and especially um, proof of life for Julian Assange. If in fact it is compromised, we cannot trust their word on Julian Assange. We need to see Julian Assange. He hasn't been seen alive in over a month now. This is ridiculous, guys. We need to be asking questions. We need answers. Um, WikiLeaks was a very important um, player in the American election, the US election that happened recently. Donald Trump, the winner, of course. Why has nobody asked Julian Assange for his view or his opinion on the US election? Um, I think he had a fair bit to do with the result. So I, I have a feeling he may have some interesting things to say and I find it very strange that, that nobody that has his phone number or anything that knows him has been able to contact him and why his internet has not been restored, although it was only supposed to be temporarily cut off because of the American election. So there's something strange going on, people. I'm not buying it. You shouldn't either. Um, we should be asking questions. We owe this to Julian Assange. He's not a criminal. He is a hero. He is a hero. Julian Assange has risked his life and the life of his family and everyone that he's close to to stand up for truth in this world full of deception and evil. And it's time that we stand up for Julian Assange. Subscribe, like, comment. Let us know that you agree that you care about Julian Assange and you want answers. Love you all and good night.